Welcome Stats Geniuses to question number one. In this grid there are four multiplications and we've got to write in the three missing numbers. Now if we know our times tables this should be a nice easy question and question one is supposed to be easy as well. So our first multiplication is along the top here and we've got four multiplied by eight and that should be 32. We've got a second multiplication along this horizontal line here. 3 times by something equals 21. Well, if you count up in threes till you get to 21, you will know that it is 7 threes. Or you could also just know that it is 3 times 7 or 7 times 3 to make 21 if you are good at your times tables. This is why being good at your times tables is very important for a question like this. Then we've got a vertical multiplication here. 4 times 3 equals 12. You should know that one. And then finally, we've got another vertical one. 8 times 7 is 56. Well, that one is actually already done for us because we got the 7 there anyway when we did 3 times 7 is 21. So this final yellow one here is just to check that the 7 is right. 3 times 7 is 21, and 8 times 7 does indeed equal 56. So that's correct. A nice easy question to start the paper with.